Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, my name is Kavya. So today's video is going to be about Sephora Dubai haul. Recently I had been to Dubai on a vacation and you all know that. I purchased a few products from Sephora Dubai. So this bag is full of those products. Stay tuned to know about the products. Before I proceed, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it yet. The first product which I really wanted, which I was dying to get my hands on was Born This Way from Too Faced. This is a foundation which I bought. Shade is a natural beige. So the packaging looks like this. It's a glass packaging. The foundation comes out with a pump. I heard a lot of good reviews about uh, Too Faced brand. It's vegan and cruelty free. There's a lot of good things added to this foundation like coconut water, alpine rose and hyaluronic acid for, for the extra added glow. It's a matte foundation. It's a medium to full coverage. Uh, it's not, Too Faced is not yet launched in India. The, this brand we can get through some Instagram sites. I bought this in two shades. One is natural beige and sad. This is almost some two, three shades deeper than me. I can mix and match for my clients. So the next product I'm going to show you is this Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. Even this is even this is cruelty free and vegan. As far as I can, I wanted to buy something which is not tested on animals. I was really interested in buying NARS but I heard tests on animals so I dropped the idea of buying NARS. Tarte is not lodged in India yet but there is but there is uh, worldwide shipping available. It's free shipping. We can get it. We can get Tarte Cosmetics from www.tartcosmetics.com These concealers in three shades. One I can use it for highlighting this I can use it for highlighting, contouring as well. The one, the one which I bought is medium, medium tan golden and rich for contouring. The next product which I bought is Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. This is in the shade 5.75 which matches my, this is exact match for my skin tone. This is good for dry skin. Uh, this has a dewy finish. Even this is this is not available in India. So whatever I'm showing is definitely not available in India. If it is available in India, I would have bought it here only. This would cost around 5,300 to 5,700. I bought these in two shades. One is in 5.75 and uh, 7.5. Even this has a similar uh, packaging like worn this way. This is gold, this is glass or acrylic, I don't know. But this has a cute packaging with a pump. Next product that I'm going to show you is Urban Decay Glitter Eyeliner. I bought in two shades because it was every shade was sold out. I could not find it in any Sephora, uh, neither in Terra or Dubai Mall. Everything, everywhere it was sold out. It was in high demand. Finally, I got it in airport with two shades. One is in this is golden, which I bought, and one more is in the pigment is insane. It's it's beautiful. This has a beautiful glitters. It's not very chunky, also. It looks beautiful with the for the lights for reception for parties. It looks great. This is a beautiful blue glitters, it's silverish blue. They said its shelf life is 6 months. I don't think I'm going to keep it for 6 months. This is going to be more by 3 months. Cut. I'm going to use it on every bride. This is such a wow color. 
next product I bought is eyeshadow palette. This is from Sephora. This is gold edition. This has some beautiful metallic colors. This one is blue. This is a grayish. Some rose gold. There are some oranges. Some gold. And this shade is to die for. But there is, I observed there is a lot of fallout, and the packaging is not very sturdy. It could have been a much better. If it falls on the ground, the, it can easily come out. It can easily break down. So another product. I'm so excited to show you all. This is Beauty Blender Foundation, which is a new launch from Beauty Blender. Uh, look at the packaging. It's so I was so fascinated to buy this. Looking at the packaging, this is a natural finish foundation. We can build it up. This is like a medium cover, medium coverage. Here there is on and off button, and if there is a bump here, the foundation pops out from this. And once we are done, we just we can just wipe it off. This is so beautiful. The first foundation where where I fell for its packaging. Even the outer packaging is so cute. It's a pink, pink with silver. Once I try, I'll I'll come to know about the. They say it's a velvety finish foundation, and there is no need of any setting powder once we apply the foundation. Uh, there is no need to set it with any powder because it's already dry. So maybe it's good for oily skin. Those who have oily skin. One is blend 3.65, another is 3.75, and I bought a tiny sample, mini size of Benny Tint for my lips and cheeks. I was looking for some healthy flush when I'm going out for some no makeup look, and it smells like a some plum. It has a plum scent, and it comes. It the color is like. Pomegranate seeds. I mean, it looks like pomegranate juice actually. One mascara, and this is a mascara which I got as a complimentary, and I didn't try it yet. This is a normal. Comes the most hyped product that. Charlotte Tilbury's Hollywood Flawless Filter for a superstar youth glow. I think we can apply this directly on the face without any foundation or as a highlighter. All over the face, this says for a superstar glow, apply all over the face as a flawless filter on top of foundation if you want an extra coverage or direct. This comes with a wand. Merit I found is this van because of the hygiene issue. It could have been like a pump or something because this has a beautiful glow, glowy look. I'm not very happy with the packaging of it, though they charge bomb. So this this was around five thousand five hundred. I got it. It was around two eighty three dirhams, I guess. And I bought a blush from the same brand. And, uh, look at the color. It's so beautiful. It looks beautiful on every skin tone, I guess. This is. Inside the packaging look, looks good, but it is not very strong compared to Dior blushes. Dior has a very sturdy packaging compared to this. Even if it falls down from somewhere, it doesn't break, I guess. But this is not very very strong. It doesn't doesn't look very strong. Packaging overall not very happy with the packaging, but the product looks good and the color. Next is this Marc Jacobs. The detailed review I have given in my other video. 
which you can check in the description box. <coughs> Next is this tiny lipstick from Marc Jacobs. The color is so beautiful. The this is a, this is a small complimentary I got it. Uh, but it's very beautiful color, very pigmented. Just one stroke, you're done. Last product which I bought is this Zoeva brushes. It's a set of 15 brushes. One for the foundation, one for the brows, one for eyeliner, one for the powder. I think this is a contour brush. Yes. One for cheeks. Zoeva brushes are so soft. It's the technique brushes. It's very, very densely packed. It's beautiful. The foundation brushes, especially. I was looking for something not very long instead of wasting so much of product. I think this is the best option. It's small. It's beautiful. It's the packaging is so beautiful and it's strong also the brushes. It feels so soft. So that is about the Sephora Dubai haul. She decided to share with you all about my about my products. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my videos. Thanks for watching. Wishing you all a happy Republic Day in advance. See you in the next video. Bye bye.